Hello and welcome to Chemistry 162, Spring 2023 at Wimber Community College. I'm your instructor, Mike Ferguson. So welcome, welcome to the class. Welcome back from winter break. So uh, the purpose of this video is to orient you to the class. I wanted to show you uh, kind of how to navigate the course, at least in the beginning, and some of the features of the class. So I have the La Lima page in open, and this is the La Lima page for this course. And here in the overview, this is where the video is going to be posted. And uh, let me jump down to the syllabus of the class. So uh, Gen Chem 2, this is the second semester for general chemistry. It's a very common class taught throughout the United States. Uh, in fact, one quarter of all college students attempt this sometime in their college career. So, uh, and at least one third of the population goes to college now. So about one twelfth of the population of the United States takes this class to give you an idea. So it's a very, very popular class. So, okay. And I'm going to talk about myself. Here's me. Uh, and office hours are Monday, Tuesday on Zoom. Uh, you don't need an appointment. You can just jump on any time. Uh, if you want to meet in person, though, I'd prefer if we, well, I'd ask that you make an appointment so then we can make sure that we're in the right place. And, and the appointments, of course, are preferred during the office hours. So, well, I want to make, and that's also for you guys so that I make sure that I'm there and uh, we're in the right place so that when we meet, you know, we don't have to sit around, wait around for each other to show up. So. Uh, and let me jump in the grading policies, run in how do I get an A in this class. So there are four tests, homework, and the final. And uh, the tests and are, and are uh, jumped into chunks. Uh, chapter 12 to 14 uh, is the first chunk. It's due February 1st. Second set, uh, 15, 16, March 1st. Uh, April 5th for the next set, chapter 17, 18. And then chapter 19 and 21 do May 3rd. May 3rd is also the end of the semester. And then the final is due May 12th. And so uh, I pick these dates because they're Wednesdays and they're the beginning of the month. I, uh, I just, I, I like to make things due on Wednesdays so that you can, if you have to, you know, enjoy your weekend kind of stuff. Uh, and these dates are flexible. So let's say you get sick, or your kids get sick, or your work has an issue, or let's say you just wanted to go on a trip, and it's the only time you can go, and you miss a deadline. It's not a big deal. Don't worry about it. You know, talk to me, email me, we can sort things out. I'm, I don't take out points off for late work. Uh, but the limit to the grace is May 12th. I cannot extend anything past May 12th, because I have to submit grades right afterwards. So please keep that in mind as far as... Uh, uh, extensions but I'm very bendy I'm very happy to work with you so don't worry about that and uh, gradients tens point split as well so uh, let me finish with talking about the syllabus and I'll talk more about where to find this work so here is the student accommodations let me sorry someone's making a lot of noise I put this on pause but uh, so student accommodations, here are student accommodations information and also academic support services. And in general, uh, if something happens, so uh, basic needs are not being met, uh, you can't find food or shelter, uh, if you are just feeling extremely anxious or depressed, you know, let me know and I'll do what I can to help you. I, I uh, can connect you up to services with the uh, university or the community. So I'm pretty well connected. I can always help you out there. So, and it's a two-way street because, like, it, it helps me as an instructor because I want you to succeed. And there's just no way that you can succeed if you if you're just hungry or if you can't find a place to sleep or if you're just there's something going on uh, that that you can't concentrate. So it really it, it's to help each other out. So uh, please keep that in mind. I do want to help you and I want to see see you succeed. So, so. Uh, let me know uh, if any of these issues uh, come to you in the semester. And it's, it's entire, that's entirely optional to you, of course. But I'm just saying that I'm here to help. OK, so uh, we talked a little bit about the grading stuff. Let me show you where that stuff is. And if you click on this vital source 
link here and it's going to look a little different for you because you're a student and I'm an instructor and you have to hit this launch courseware stuff and then go to open my lab and mastering and if I do that it's going to log me out of here. I like it better here. Here is the um, the the course that uh, we have for you and here it is here. Uh, again it's going to look a little different for you because you're a student and I'm an instructor but if you click on these assignments here and this is where you find the assignments and so I'm going to click on chapter 12 and if you want to do the homework you click on one of these and uh, here is the assignments right there. So a couple things to think about uh, what, what can go wrong. Uh, first of all, browser type. Safari tends not to work as well. You can use Safari. Uh, Chrome tends to work the best. I'm using uh, Firefox because I like Firefox for this. Uh, you also have to have the pop-up blockers turned off because you can see the, the assignments. They appear in a pop-up window, so you cannot block pop-ups. Uh, if you can't log in, a lot of times if you... Uh, clear your cache, reset your browser. That that tends to work well. Sometimes you have to reload a few times. Uh, mastering can be a pain, so uh, it's not the it's not the well. It, it can have issues sometimes, and sometimes there's maintenance on it. Uh, there's also maintenance in La Lima sometimes too. So uh, keep that in mind. But uh, if you ever get confused, feel free to to ask me some questions about it. Uh, and let me go back to uh, the La Lima page. And if you see here on the, on the tabs, we have the different chapters. I'm going to click on chapter 12 to show you the uh, learning space for chapter 12. And uh, so here is what I have. Uh, so I have uh, blank notes. So I've broken these lectures up into smaller pieces. And you can click on these blank notes. Uh, you can, it's the same stuff that I'm going over in the lecture. Uh, and here's the lecture right here on YouTube. Uh, and uh, you can take the blank notes, you can print them out, you can put them on your tablet, and then you can use them as guided notes as you go through. And I have the completed notes from this lecture here. So uh, that's so it's to mimic some of your classroom experience. And then of course, link to mastering chemistry. So and that's in general that so uh, if you have any questions uh, please let me know uh, I'm here to help you and uh, so I hope you have a great first week and aloha